McDowell County conducted testing in Keystone for vulnerability and minority populations. Newswatch reporter Jacob Comer has more. COVID-19 is affecting everyone across the planet, but it seems to be affecting minority populations more so than the population as a whole. J.J. Rose with the McDowell County Health Department says the county is working on testing more people in minority populations to get more accurate population data. Around the state, uh, different dates and, and different counties, we're doing some uh, testing for the COVID-19, but uh, this particular testing, we're trying to target minority populations, and so that's why these last two dates we've done, we've kind of pinpointed into the minority population, so we're trying to get that into our numbers. This minority testing is especially important because the information can help benefit other states as well. Positive cases for the minority populations are rising higher than others in not just West Virginia, but other states as well. We're trying to target the minority population because, as you know, in West Virginia as in other states, the percent of positives for COVID-19 in the minority population is outpacing the actual percent of population in the state and in surrounding states. Ideally, the large number of people tested gives scientists more data to work with when they figure out infection rates and the number of people likely affected. And then that information can help more people in the future. The more testing you get, the better picture you can get with that. And then hopefully if there is something uh, that we see going on, that'll help us to get more information out and possibly more pinpointed information to the particular people we need to get that to. And according to JJ, this operation is taking the help from the whole community. It's more than just the health department. People have to go and be willing to be tested and officials from all around the county come out to help. This thing is bigger than one agency. It takes everybody to get this going because, again, you know, it is statewide, it is countrywide, it is planetwide, unfortunately. So everybody's working together, and I just want to appreciate everybody. The testing was free and available for anyone without a doctor's note. The testing will give scientists more results to work with when they examine data, and then they can hopefully pinpoint ways to help minority communities lower their positive testing rate in the future. This has been Jacob Comer reporting for WOAY Newswatch. The testing in McDowell County took over two days. Anyone with symptoms can still call their local health department for help getting tested.